Welcome back to Runiverse. I'm Andrew. Hi, I'm Tiffany. And in this video, we're going to open a booster box of Build Divide. So this is all in Japanese, and we don't read Japanese, so we're just going to open up and see what we get. All right, let's Ooh, see. I'm excited. And Tiffany, you have not opened a TCG pack before. Not yet. Is that true? Yeah, this is my first time, so we'll see what is inside. Well, it's cards, yeah. I know, <laughs> but how does it look, right? Right, how does it look, yeah. Okay. So we can open this up. Oh, so it folds open like this. It looks nice for their um, animate color picture. Yeah, this is a very brightly colored game. So we have this card. I don't know what it is. Doesn't look very exciting. I think there are different cards you could get in this spot, and I'm gonna guess that this one is not the most exciting one. It's probably just a sample. Well, it's right. not a sample, but it's like a bonus card. Oh, okay. But I don't know if it's a good bonus card or not. Just think it is. Just think it is? Okay. Yes. <laughs> so that is a really good bonus card. We're excited about <laughs> All right, let's see. I like the back though. It's fancy. Yeah? Mm -hmm. All right, so why don't you just hold the cards right in the middle here. Okay. And just take off one at a time and see what you think. Mm. It's whoa, nice. Whoa, whoa, one at a time. Don't, don't reveal the bottom cards. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> wow. I can see I like it. I don't know. That's These are first ones are probably just commons. Okay. I like how it feels, actually. It's kind of... They have a good thickness. Yeah. Better quality, I guess. All right, let's see the next one. Oh, it's a little... Like a Ooh. demon kid or an angel kid. I don't know. Cute. Ooh. A minotaur. Oh, he's got three hits. That's actually kind of high, the number three here. So it takes... Means it can hit your opponent really hard. I see. Nice but down. he costs eight, so that's a lot. I really like the enemy. Ooh. Creepy. Okay. Monster? Yeah. What kind of monster is it? I think this is actually a... It looks like it's a shot spell or an uh, event card. So this is an... A, it's a picture of a monster, but it's actually an effect card. I see. Interesting. Ooh, a lizard what is guy. That? Lizard? Okay. Crocodile. Never seen it before. All right, I see hints of that back card coming through. Okay. Ooh, this is shiny. The best one. Really nice picture, too. Rares or super rares. So this actually is an ultra rare. This is Elizabeth, Angel of the Law. And of course, she costs six in white. And she's got the buster symbol, but um, she has judgment. So whenever your opponent plays a creature, she get, you get a judgment counter. And as long as your territory is open when she's placed, you can remove a judgment counter to draw a card and place a unit from your hand with total cost five or less into play. So you pay six for her, but you get a free five drop as long as you have your territory open and you get to draw a card. So this is actually is a very powerful, powerful card. Pretty in. Nice. Pretty and nice. Yes. Yes, she's very elegant. Very, very, yes. Ooh. And that's the end of our first pack. Okay. You ready for our second pack? Sure. I'm excited. Yay! I actually like the color. Of the blue? Part. Yeah. No, it's, it's just like the quality, the nice look and how hard it, it is. All right, well, let's go to the next card then. Okay. It's a blue card. Ooh, Ooh a I like how Pretty white look. horse. Yes. Oh, this is a simple card. So it's a 5,500, and I don't need to know Japanese to know that it gets plus 3,000 when your territory is open. So it could be an 8,500 for only four cost. Not bad. Mm-hmm. Next. Oh. Oh, how cute. Cute Aww. fox. Next. Oh, that's... Okay. That's a creepy, little bit creepy. Creepy yes. black card. Mm -hmm. Looks like a monster too. Mm -hmm. Some kind. Okay. Ooh, a quick red spell. So they can get plus 2,000 or plus 5,000 sometimes. Okay. Ooh. 
very spooky. I like it's it. It's got like three mouths all connected in one. Yeah. How many jaws do you have, honey? Oh my God. <laughs> well, I have one, but <laughs> this one is <laughs> creepy. Yeah. yeah. But I like it though. Nice. Oh, and there we go. It's got nice. a super rare. And this is one of the uh, aces, one of the aces. All right, so this is Margulis Evil Eye Demon Lord, one of the black ace units alongside Bloom. Although I guess this is the other option if you don't want to play the starter deck Bloom. Um, so he costs only five, which is nice. Which And he says he can also attack units in stand. So you can... All your opponent's units are susceptible to Margulis, and as long and he'll open your territory. And as long as it is open at the start of your end phase, if he's attacked this turn, but the opponent's foremost life card in their graveyard, so it's just like a free life damage every turn. Mm -hmm. uh, as long as he, as long as he attacked, so he wants to keep attacking. Do not keep him back on defense. Mm -hmm. Seems like very powerful, and I like the look. He has six pack. Oh yeah, he does have a six pack. Uh oh, competition from Margulis the Demon Lord. Oh, I see. Mm. <laughs> All right, pack three time. All right, here you go, Tiffany. We can go fast through the commons. Okay. Ooh. It's a cool owl. This one has a little bit of a different art style. I like the lines and the sketchy look. It looks like American Eagle, but you know. Yikes. Ooh, she cute. Cool battle lady. Yes. You like her hairstyle? Yeah. Cute. He looks cool. Oh, oh my creepy god. Creepy chameleon guy. What a long tongue. Vanilla. Mm. Is he eating a crystal? It seems like it. Yeah. Hmm. It's crystal. Ooh. Creepy monster. There's a cool bird guy in red. Guess if you want to build a bird deck, you need red and white. Look at the the nails. <laughs> you grow out your fingernails like that? Oh, I might. <laughs> <laughs> uh, ooh, I like how shiny. Oh, is it foil? It's, oh, it's like a reverse. Yes. It's just it's the like the same different. card, but with foiling? Yes. A Can we see shiny. that? Does that come yes. through? Oh, there you go. A little bit of sparkle. Yeah. Oh, and here I've revealed our rare here. Oh, <gasps> how cute. Bunny. So that's uh, Agora the Watchful White Rabbit. When she's placed, if your life is in yellow zone, which means you haven't taken too much damage yet, you can put the frontmost card of your life into energy. So if you haven't taken too much damage, you can choose to take one, and but you get extra energy, so you can pay high, more expensive cards faster. And she gets plus 3,000 once your territory is over, bringing her up to 7,000 for only a four cost. It's a pretty strong card as well. And it's got a cool, like, silvery text effect on there. Mm -hmm. Can you see that? And even the buster symbol, that skull there, is silvered. Yep. Not bad. Put that with our super rare and our ultra rare down here. All right, pack three. Ooh. It's a cool, elegant lady. Oh my god, I love the I look. I like her. Yeah, I like her yes. mystic look. Big Ooh. gun. Hmm. Which do you prefer? You want to look like that with that dress, or you want to carry that gun around? No, I think I'm good. <laughs> I like to look cute. Okay. Well, you're lucky then, because you do. Thanks. Some pixies, something. That's like sure a quick spell. Okay. Yeah. Oops. <gasps> Skeleton Ooh. waiter. Look like a Halloween costume. <laughs> yeah. It's a pretty good Halloween costume, though, if he took all the skin off his head. Yeah. Would you be interested if somebody stuff you? Oh, here you why? Uh, I don't trust people with no skin, huh? <laughs> okay. Ooh, a, big, a dragon? Yeah. A Red dinosaur dragon. or something? Dinosaur. Ooh, what is that? Okay, so this is the red territory. Um, or it's one of them. So it's got this guy on the back. Oh, I like the back. Which means if you don't want to play the red 
starter deck character, you could play this one instead. I but see. you probably need um really interesting. You need to get some copies of that guy though to go with it. Okay. And here's a rare. The so, souvenir? Yeah, it's a rare card. It's got the silver letters again. Here the oh, shot see. symbols silvered. Is this a powerful one too? So this is heavy ballistic missile despair. And it costs five, but it deals 10,000 damage, which is enough to take out most units most of the time. So pretty much if you pay five energy, you can just kill something. But it's also a shot trigger, so you can sometimes you can just play it for free mm -hmm. as a surprise. So I would say it's pretty strong, but I'm not super excited about it. Me too. But it could be just like a staple for a blue deck, I suppose. Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh my god. A Tommy girl. We got a tomboy girl here with her. So the the story behind the blue world, all the blue cards, they take place in a world where there's no men. Okay. So that's why all the women fight each other. Because I guess if the men aren't there to fight, then the women have to do it. Oh really? I don't know. I you guess like, so. You like it like that? I didn't say that. <laughs> why do people need to fight all the time? Oh my god! <laughs> I like these girl houses. She looks You like the angelic girls? Yes. Oh yeah, do you like her outfit? Yeah. Yeah. Nice I think her dress her. she might need to pull her skirt down a little bit. <laughs> you wish. Oh there she's playing with her gun, fixing it up with duct tape. Okay. She's got those abs you like. Mm. Not really. <laughs> you like it more on the demon guy? Yeah, a cute look evil pretending to be nice. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that is symbol custom. All right, should I move it? Mm -hmm. okay. Ooh, cute otter. Mm -hmm. Ooh, how many eyes is that? One, two, at least three, five, four, five oh, six, six, seven, seven eight, 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 right here, too. Wow, so many eyes. It's a lot. Yeah, I bet he can see a lot. <laughs> <laughs> can see everything <laughs> except for behind him so we don't know how many eyes he has in the back do we yeah true Ooh, oh there you go i'm not a cute looking is what that is this, the eyes on the top so is this too many eyes again no i think she's just got blood all over her oh uh, but she's got a little doll with her Ooh. so this is painful roamer she's actually a demon mm. did you recognize that no not I really i couldn't tell i thought she was a little girl yeah when she's placed, you put the top card of your deck and the frontmost card of your life into your graveyard. Mm. So she's only four costs for 6,000, which is not bad compared like this one is four costs for 4,000. So she's bigger, but you have to pay a card from the top of your deck and a life point. Mm -hmm. But you get to put them in your graveyard. And if you're playing like Bloom, you might be able to bring it back. Next one. Here's my hand. Ooh, what a powerful looking. Oh, he looks like he's straight out of Dragon Ball Z. Isn't it? Yeah. Wow. Okay. We got a helicopter. Mm. Ooh, a fire cat. It doesn't look or like a cat. A lemur or Oh, they got burned. Some kind of animal. No, it's not a cat. No. Bat. No, just kidding. I don't know. A beast. Oh, there you go. Ooh. Some kind of succubus demon hmm. with tentacle legs. Is that snake part of her legs? Uh, or maybe the snake is the real creature and this is just the... It just puts that on the end of its tail to lure people in to eat it. No calamari looking. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? A little oh. girl who lives in the woods? Looks and like she got raised too. by wolves. Yes. Ooh. Oh, this looks like another territory. So it's a white territory. Do they have the back looking? Wow. Yep. So it's you? a man. Yeah, it's an angel guy. Okay. And it kind of looks like fairy wings. Mm-hmm. And then we got a rare. It seems like she is powerful, but like she only has 3,000. Yeah, she's small, but she only costs three. So that's good. Let's see. That's uh, Alkali's Spirit of Rainbows. I like the sound of that. When she's placed, you target up to one of your opponent's units with a total cost four or less and return it to their hand. So that's pretty good. You could play her early and then just slow your opponent down by returning their creature. And if your territory is open, she gets plus 3,000. So maybe she costs three, but she can be 6,000 mm. if you played open your territory. So 
So if you have this and then you flip it, then she's 6,000. Wow. Yeah. So not bad. Powerful. Yeah, and this is a, another one of the rares. So I wonder if we'll get any more super rares or ultra rares out of here. <laughs> I don't know how many come per box. Sometimes they put the best cards on the bottom of the box. Oh, I see. That's why, okay. Let's find out mm -hmm. if we're lucky. <gasps> oh, that's kind of nice. Well, interesting. So it's some kind what of spell. That? I don't know. Spell? Well, just, yeah, just angelic stuff going on. Okay. Called Judgment just by Common by Sense. Sense. Remove any amount of judgment counters and then return all your opponent's units with a total cost equal to or less than the amount of judgment counters removed to their hand. Interesting. So you have to collect a lot of judgment counters if you want to return anything. So honestly, I think this might not, not be that good. Them. Yeah, okay. unfortunately. Okay. Well, there's oh. a big airship. Carry your weapons around. All your blue army ladies. Oh, not a cute lady. You like the white cards the most? Yes. Is that where Tiffany would fit in? <laughs> Maybe. Not the demon armor headless Maybe Andrew's going to fit in. <laughs> That's me. He's got an eyeball in his hand. So yeah. Ooh. They're not messing around with the eyeballs. Oh. Turtle fighter. Turtle. I would not want to brawl that guy. Ooh. He's got glowing hands. You know that's going to be risky to fight him. Some kind of spooky mask conversation, conversation going on. Ooh. And, oh, we did get another super rare. I like her hair. Oh, she's pretty strong too. Yamira. Yamira Rack Gunner. So let's see, six costs for 6,000, but she hits for two, but that's regular for big costing things. And if all your energy is at rest, she gets plus 3,000. So all you have to do is spend all your energy and she gets bigger. You like spending energy. Mm -hmm. No, you like saving. And then she has a territory ability which means if your territory is open and when she's placed, if all of your energy is rested, so if you spend all your money this turn, target a unit and deal 5,000 damage to it and then draw a card. So it's pretty good. You just spend all your money and kill something when she comes into play. Very interesting. So she's pretty simple but straightforward. Sounds like she likes shooting with guns. Not bad. Mm -hmm. All right, next pack, something shooting. We should probably, I feel like we haven't seen very many repeat cards yet. Mm -hmm. Angel with handcuffs shooting around. Oh, the angel, yes. A lady with blue energy. Mm -hmm. Oh, Ooh. there's a repeat, a minotaur. I like that one. Somebody stabbing somebody. Mm -hmm. Oh, and then we got another one of this uh, demon. I actually like this card. This kind of card I like where you, you pay a cost. Oh, wait, there's a card behind it. We got a rare... And a super rare. Oh, wait, is it super? Or it's just another rare? We got two rares in the same pack. Wow. Not bad. So this is a primitive dinner. Put the top card of your deck in your energy zone at rest. So it's a very straightforward effect just to help you ramp up energy faster. And the starter deck, Ace, wants you to have, or territory wants you to have eight energy. So it's another card that can help you do that. And... I guess the reason we had two rares is that one of them is this uh, reverse hollow. So it's not only is it a rare, but it's a reverse hollow rare. So they both have the silvering effect on their text, but this one has the foil effect all across the card. Ooh, what is that? Okay, so there's some angel guy with his staff swinging around. It's a quick spell. Mm -hmm. I think we, this, she looks familiar, but I don't think we've actually seen her yet. Just walking down the hallway with a gun. Mm. That's a dangerous plant. Mm. Another quick spell. Ooh. Some ghost demon guys. Cat lady. Oh, is that cat lady? Oh, I love cat lady. <laughs> it's not the board game cat lady, honey. <laughs> but you can check out our other video where we play cat lady. Oh, here we go. There's another, there's that guy we saw before. Yes. So pretty much, if we want to play with this card, we need four of this card. Oh, I see. So, but we put this in our deck, and then we start with this outside the game, and it starts like this. Wow. He's hang, lazy sitting on his throne, but once we play him, then this flips over and the territory it's opens. Be like, what? And okay. we get this ability here. Mm-hmm. 
And then here's our rare. That's Claudia Lead Striker. Once per turn, you can target a unit and deal 3,000 damage to it. So it might just take out a unit or it might just finish something off. And as long as your territory is open, if all your energy is at rest, she can't be attacked and she gets plus one hit. So that one becomes a two, which is not bad. And this is another one of the ace units. So if we get the territory that goes with her, just like him, um, she's got a territory that goes along with her. Oh my God, how cute little chicken. Chicken with binoculars? Yeah. Did you expect to see chicken with binoculars? Not really. Because I know I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there's oh, a, oh, no, a lady with a gun. That I did expect. Yes. Okay, we've seen that guy, that lady before. Angel with the staff. Ooh. This guy, not really. Looking very creepy. This looks like a magic something. Yeah, like he's going to do a magic trick mm -hmm. with his bones. There's mm. a dog wanderer. Creepy oh, demon with five one. 17 mouths. And, Ooh. wow, another super rare. So this is Margeria, the Angel of Judgment. When your opponent plays a creature, you get a Judgment counter with the Judgment ability. And um, quick action, you can remove two Judgment counters, target a unit, and nullify all the damage it would take for the rest of the turn. So spend Judgment to save your units. And um, if your territory is open and you've removed at least one Judgment counter this turn, she gets plus 5,000 power and a hit. So she really wants you to spend your Judgment counters. Such a powerful witch. A witch? Is that? Is she? Is she a witch? She's like an angel, right? Oh, angel. Is yeah, she she's an angel. Powerful? What angels can't be powerful? Oh. Well, I'm sorry. Next she's you're gonna get her judgment. <gasps> oh my God! What is that? More of the wisp pixie, whatever. Protecting something. Protecting or attacking. Uh, oh, the lady on the motorcycle. Mm. This guy. Another. Dragon Ball Z demon guy. Yes. Statue. Headless armor. Oh, another cute. Lady of the woods. Oh, something. I don't know. Oh, my Just Light gosh. swords. Yes. Oh, that's a foil, too. Mm -hmm. Reverse foil. It's nice. Yes, foil. Shiny look. Yeah. And we got a rare. This is a command with the shot trigger called Caged Principle. You target a unit with a total cost three or less and return it to hand. So you just want to return something to hand at quick speed, but only little guys. Oh, here's our lady fixing the gun again. Angel with handcuffs. Space airship. Space airship. Ooh, Eye eyes demon. Again. Ooh, another burning. Something. Another burning something. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a big thing. Ooh. So I wonder, is that the one that goes with Claudia that we got? Can you read the Japanese here, honey? Does that say the same thing? Oh, I wish I can translate. <laughs> no, it looks like they say something else. So this is they don't match. Oh yeah, see oh. that's a different girl. So this is not Claudia. This is somebody it's else. It looked like the girl with the pink hair earlier that we seen. Remember? One of the cards. But I don't know. Yeah, I don't think we got that one, but maybe somebody else with pink hair. Okay. And then what's next? Ooh, volcano. This is special. What does it do? Earth split asunder. Target a unit. Put it in the energy zone as rest. Oh, wow. So you can kill your opponent's unit, but then they get it as energy. Or if your own creature is about to die, you can turn it into energy for yourself. Well, powerful. I like so, it. Not bad. I can save this for myself. You want it? Yeah. All for you, honey. Mm -hmm. Ooh, what next? Another spell. It's another pack. We got another one of that card. Yes. Remove spend judgment counters. Oh, there's a little helicopter drone with a gun. GW920. I can read that. <laughs> Glad. It's Angel Lady looks familiar, but I don't know if we actually saw this one yet. No, I don't think so. A lot of wind. Mm -hmm. Stabby Stabby. Cat Lady. 
Oh, demon succubus snake. And, oh, here we go. Ooh, There's something. Very shiny red. Yeah, so we got this super rare Badratos, the That's Wrath of Badratos. the Raging Flames. Badratos? I don't know. He can't be targeted by your opponent except by your opponent's commands that are played as triggers. So you can get surprised, but your opponent can't plan anything against him. And as long as your territory is open, which he will open it for you, um, you put him into your energy zone at rest and target a non-shapeshifter unit from your energy zone with a total cost of nine or less and put it into play. So basically he can shapeshift in anything else from your energy zone as long as it's not too big. So he can transform into big dinosaurs or something like that. Wow. It's kind of cool. Mm -hmm. We have two. Two more after this? Yes. All right. Another gun girl. No. Uh, I think we had it. Yep. Ooh, Sailor Moon. <laughs> Sailor, Sailor Moon grew up. <laughs> Office girl. Carnivorous plant. Shadow demons. Ooh. Oh, okay. I think this is uh, the terrain that goes with that? our Ooh. angel lady here. Yeah. So she should be on the other side. Oh. There she is. Wow, very pretty. And then we got this rare. So she's called Emma Parkour Tracer. And she can attack ignoring decoys. Which is okay. Look like her. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Cost four for 5,000, so a little bit higher rate. And she can ignore decoys, so there you go. So that's our penultimate pack. We got this guy again, with the angel with the staff, lady with the blue light, lady with the staff again, other lady. Oh, the dog. The dog guy. The conversation. The conversation. Oh. Ooh. What is this super rare angel cool guy? Godness, the angel of melee combat. When he's destroyed, you can remove him from your graveyard to. Target a card from your graveyard, return it to your deck, and shuffle. Okay. So that's not very exciting so far. But when he's placed from your deck, look at the top card of your deck. Place it on your side of the field, up to one unit with a total cost four or less from among them. Okay. Put the rest at the bottom in any order. That seems a little weird. I don't know how you're supposed to place him from your deck. Maybe that works with some of the other cards that I haven't read yet, but normally you don't place cards from your deck, so I don't know how his ability is ever supposed to happen. But maybe it's good. It's very shiny. He look cute, but confused. <laughs> Just as confused as me. Yes. And there's one more card behind it. Mm. What do we got? Ooh. Okay, so I guess this is, maybe this is a fancy, super rare, but we got just a kind of regular rare back here. Mm -hmm. Just hanging out. So she says, rest this unit, put the top card from both players' deck to their respective graveyards, and if they're both units, then choose a player to lose their a life. So you get to play a little gambling game and fill out players' graveyards. Not bad. All right, you ready for the last pack? Yes. Finally, the last one. You're excited for it to end? No. I just want to see maybe the last one, maybe the best. That's true. Usually the last is the best. The last is the best? Yes. Okay. Right. Let's believe in it together. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got. Ooh. So we got new blue common here. We haven't seen this one yet. No, not really. Oh, there's oh. the chicken with binoculars to give <laughs> us some luck. Oh, this oh. girl looks lonely in the desert. The... Yep, the, the brawling turtle, the demon butler magician. Magician. Oh, this lady looking ominously over her shoulder at the big boat. And what do we got here? Ooh. Oh, regular rare. Regular rare. Angel of magic. Doug Lark, the angel of oppression. For each of your other units, he gets plus 3,000. That could be big. So he's actually small by himself. 
But if you have at least one print for him, he's 6,000 for only five costs. It's pretty good. Mm -hmm. And um, he, unit, this unit's hit cannot be changed. So that one is always going to be a one. But when this unit attacks, you can rest one of your other units in order to stand him, which means if he's your biggest guy, mm -hmm. you can attack with him over and over again. You just have to rest your, you have to spend, okay. give up attacks from your other, from your teammates. And this is kind of your ace unit if you want to build around him, I guess. I see. I didn't mention, but it looks like this is one of the territories. I think this is the one that goes for Claudia that we skipped over that. But that's okay. I think uh, we're good for now. Over oh, right here, she right here. Yeah. Yeah. So I think that's her territory, right? Mm-hmm. Yep. So there she is on the back. Wow. Saluting. And we ended with Doug Lark, but we got a uh, ultra rare and we got a few super rares, so not bad. So what's one of your favorite? Oh, my favorite? Mm-hmm. Well, of course, I like getting ultra rares. I really like shapeshifters too, though. I like this one. Well, I think he looks the coolest to me. Well, actually, I like this one. Oh, you do? Yeah, the most. The most? Yeah. Better quality and very shiny, very powerful. And I think she looks very powerful too. Yeah. I'm going to go with this one. It's a rare and a, like a reverse foil rare. Okay. And I like her effect. Simple, but strong. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe so we can get more subscribers. And bye. Bye. Honey, those girls are sexy.